won the race. And the board will remember that a few years ago when we were planning this building, we had a very legitimate concern that whether we could get the building done before the Massey building collapsed in a cloud of asbestos-laden dust. We got the building done, came in under budget, came in lead silver, came in as an environmental landmark and just a phenomenal building. You know, I know there are people in the county who think development is bad, but I got 50 million good reasons why the development that this board has supported is good. And it's not just that 50 million, but every business pays B poll. Or we see the B poll numbers went up. Part of that's from me, by the way, folks. Uh, <laughs> Certainly, the best thing I got to do with the Park Authority was saving Lake Akatink. This action item approves in full the proposed plan for saving Lake Akatink. And we got together a financing plan and a plan to dredge the lake and save it forever. And that's going to be a great achievement. I, John C. Cook. I, John C. Cook. Do solemnly swear. Do solemnly swear. That I will support the Constitution. I think what I'll miss most about the board is the ability to make a difference, the ability to work together with people to solve problems, take advantage of opportunities, uh, get things done that matter for the community. That's the good part of the job. Not only is Diversion First uh, a good thing for people, it's a good thing for the criminal justice system, it's a good thing fiscally. Several hundred, hundreds of people who need mental health treatment um, are getting that treatment when they weren't getting it before. I think it's uh, critical that the public safety initiatives, Diversion First, public safety staffing, and the ad hoc recommendations need to be fiscally constrained. Um, we save these priorities by constraining them because if we don't constrain them fiscally, every year we'll say they're too big to fund and uh, these programs are too important to do that.